Is Bitcoin finally shaking off the climate villain label? <laughs> well, according to a brand new report from the Cambridge Center for Alternative Finance, over 52% of Bitcoin mining is now powered by sustainable energy and North America is leading the charge. Okay, here's the breakdown. The US controls 75.4% of reported Bitcoin mining. It's a massive geographic shift from the pre-2021 days when China dominated the hash rate. But after China's crackdown, partly driven by its carbon neutrality goals, mining had to adapt. Fast forward three years and miners are now chasing cleaner energy and smarter strategies. Let's look at the numbers. Okay, so hydropower is now the largest sustainable source at 23.4% of all Bitcoin mining. Wind comes next at 15.4%. Nuclear is at 9.8% and solar is at just 3.2%, but growing fast. Meanwhile, fossil fuels still power about 47.6% of the Bitcoin network, but the momentum is shifting. And while Bitcoin mining's total power use is up 17% year over year, now at 138 terawatt hours annually, over half of that energy is now coming from renewables. That's a huge turnaround from the dirty Bitcoin headlines of the past. So. Why does this matter? Well, firstly, it kills the Bitcoin is bad for the planet narrative. Secondly, it opens the door to ESG aligned institutional adoption, if that still exists. And finally, it proves Bitcoin can innovate under pressure. But here's the twist. Even as Bitcoin gets cleaner, mining profits are shrinking. The report warns that the industry is at a critical juncture. Unless miners can start diversifying into things like AI compute, waste heat recovery, and energy arbitrage, some will not survive the next cycle. Still, this is a massive win for Bitcoin, not just as a financial network, but as an energy innovation engine. So is Bitcoin finally becoming ESG friendly? Are AI data centers the new ocean boilers? Does it even matter? Light me up in the comments and follow for more sharp takes on the front lines of crypto and energy.